Let's take a look here at the resource graph. So Terraform builds a dependency graph from the Terraform configurations and walks this graph to generate plans, refresh state, and more. When you use Terraform Graph, this is a visual representation or presentation of the dependency graph. If you're wondering what a dependency graph is, in mathematics, it's a directed graph representing dependencies of several objects towards each other. So it's pretty much like nodes uh, with relationships between other nodes. Uh, so that is one that I generated out um, from Terraform. And so there's a few different types here. We have a resource node that represents a single resource. A resource meta node represents a group of resources but does not represent any action on its own. And provider configuration node, so represents the time to fully configure a provider. Uh, will you need to know this for the exam? Probably not. Do you need to know this in great detail? Probably not, because there's a lot to the resource graph. But the idea here is just kind of like Terraform saying, just so you know, we're using a graph database and graph databases are very well suited for uh, this kind of stuff. Uh, and that's why uh, Terraform is very good at um, uh, figuring out conflicts uh, and things like that, okay?